Dogs come in a variety of sizes, temperaments and training abilities, but dogs that have fluffy and thick coats seem to be in higher demand. Fluffy dogs also come in different sizes and colours. If you decide to adopt one, it's worth noting that you'll need to invest in regular grooming to keep their coats healthy and looking great. Some dogs have a hairy coat that is almost rough to the touch. Others have a fluffy coat that flaps in the breeze, making them look more like a running marshmallow. For most breeds, the best way to maximize the fluffiness of your dog is to groom them regularly. But really, who wouldn't want to have a cuddly, fluffy dog? If you can't get enough of fluffy dogs and think it may be time to add one to your family, you're in the right place to find out which one is the best for you. So without further ado, here are the top 10 most fluffy dog breeds. Number 10. Tibetan Mastiff Called one of the most expensive dogs in the world, the Tibetan Mastiff is a large, fluffy breed. With an impressive mane covering the neck and shoulders and a long, thick coat, these dogs need to be groomed several times a week to remove shedding. Weighing 175 pounds and standing 30 inches tall, the Tibetan Mastiff is a beast. No wonder these Mastiffs have been used for centuries to raise livestock. Despite its appearance, this dog has a large heart and can be very affectionate and cuddly to its owner. They are calm, patient and want nothing more than to spend time with their family all day. Having a dog this size comes with a few obstacles. Early training and socialization are essential. You want your Mastiff to feel comfortable around children, other pets and strangers. But this breed is recognized to be very stubborn and obedience isn't at the top of their priorities. Number 9. Kershond The Kershond is an old breed and has long been bred as family companions as well as guard dogs. These dogs have a long, dual coat with prominent colors of grey, cream and black. These dogs were bred in the Netherlands to guard barges along rivers. They became loyal and social dogs. Kishon coats are the perfect fur coat for running in cold weather or lounging on the sofa after a long day. This large furry tail and fox-like ears give the Kishon a particularly bright and friendly appearance. Known for their trainability and obedience, these intelligent dogs do well with plenty of interaction and exercise. All that fur is just asking for a puddle of hugs. Number 8. Bichon Frise The Bichon Frise is a small fluffy dog. They are very into people, which is great if you're looking for a companion animal. Their coat is usually trimmed, although you can also let their coat grow long. It is an intelligent, affectionate and playful companion, perfect for all ages of humans. But it needs plenty of beauty time to keep them stylish. They get along well with children and get along well with other dogs. This breed is sought after by allergy sufferers due to its infrequent shedding. All the hair that Bichons shed is found under their undercoat. The Bichons share a common ancestor with the Barbettes and have at one time fought to maintain their role as circus performers. Due to their warm personalities and exquisite looks, Bichons make excellent showbiz dogs. Number 7. Samoid Want a dog that makes all your neighbors jealous? When you walk with your Samoid, you will attract attention. With an impressive snow white coat, this fluffy breed is high maintenance and during shedding season, you'll need to brush their hair every day. If you have time to brush their hair, you'll get plenty of rewards as their cuteness is second to none and they've even been nicknamed Sammy Smile for their big and happy smiles. Samoid has a playful personality and pairs well with a good and athletic owner. They are quirky, loyal and super intelligent. They are also known to be a bit aloof, especially with anyone outside their family. Samoids tend to be gentler and more easygoing, perhaps because they have spent centuries living and working in some of the world's coldest climates. Regular brushing helps control their continued shedding. Number 6. Havanese these extremely affectionate dogs are perfect for families looking for a companion animal. Havanese love spending time with their people and are extremely people orientated. They tend to have separation anxiety, so make sure not to leave them alone for too long. Havanese have a luxurious coat of many colors. It can be left long or cut short for easier grooming. Daily brushing is recommended to avoid tangles and regular trimming around the back should be a priority to keep it fresh. Of course, these dogs can learn to live on their own, but this requires some training. They will always be a little clingier than other breeds. The Havanese is a fun-loving dog, making it a great choice for families with children and other pets. They are also relatively easy to train. The Havanese is a good choice for beginners who don't mind their above-average grooming needs. Number 5. Pomeranian 
One of the most popular toy dog breeds, Pomeranians have fluffy fur and a grin like a fox. At no more than seven pounds, this breed knows how to command. The small but mighty dog has a double coat and a coat of undercoat that covers its chest. While it can be a happy house dog, this dog breed is very active and excels in competitions of agility and obedience. Pomeranians naturally come from friendly and active personalities, as they are descended from Arctic sled dogs. They are smart and quick learners, so teach them lots of tricks to keep them engaged. Regular one-to-one -one grooming sessions during the week help keep the Pom's coat looking great. Number four, Shih Tzu. The Shih Tzu is one of the most popular small fluffy dog breeds in the United States. You've probably seen at least one of these fluffy dogs. Shih Tzus are famous for their long, flowing coats, but they can be cut into a shorter, softer coat to make it more manageable. These little dogs were bred to be royal palace dogs. Although they are very playful and docile, you are more likely to see them curled up in their favourite spot rather than playing outside. They are great if you want to find your furry best friend as they are some of the most loyal and affectionate dog breeds. However, they can be a bit possessive, so early socialisation is important. Number three, Lhasa Apso. The Lhasa Apso's long straight hair is the hallmark of this small breed. This breed is very affectionate with the family and also has a great sense of humour. Get ready to laugh and fall in love with this dog. They may not be very similar in size, but the Lhasa Apsos were actually bred to be used as guard dogs. They serve as guard dogs in Tibetan monasteries, where they bark to deter intruders and warn the monks. These dogs are often kept as companion dogs or for dog shows. In the former category, their lovely chic aesthetic, coupled with their intelligence and curiosity, are what make them such a hit. Number two, Chow Chow. Chow Chows are large, fluffy dogs with long, thick coats. Despite their large coat, they are very low maintenance and do not tend to shed much. But you'll need to brush these teddy bears' hair often to keep their coat nice. Chows have a very thick double coat around their mane and they have a distinctive blue tongue. Plus, Chow Chows look like walking teddy bears. So if you want everyone around you to fall in love with their cuteness, then a Chow is the right choice. They are extremely big, but also quite bulky. They can be quite large, but some are relatively small. Although these dogs look fluffy and adorable, they are quite protective and wary of strangers. They need a lot of training and socialization to get along with other dogs. They also tend to be aggressive in relation to dogs, so they don't do well in multi-dog households. And finally, we have number one, Alaskan Malamut. Alaskan Malamut is a powerful breed and is often used for sledding hiking and backpacking in the harsh Arctic. They are the definition of a big and fluffy dog. One of the oldest sled breeds in the Arctic, these dogs were bred for long distance transport of goods. Alaskan Malamut is usually a combination of white and gray, black or sable. They have a white face and a large fluffy tail. When it comes to density, Malamut has a very thick double coat. These coats also blow off several times a year. Daily brushing helps control their hair. These dogs are a handful in family homes because they tend to pull, dig, chase and shed. They are very independent and require years of training to overcome stubbornness. Nevertheless, this dog is not recommended for first time owners. There are few things on this planet that give you the satisfaction of running your hand through the thick coat of a fluffy dog. It's really what dreams are made of. All dogs are wonderful and fluffy, from small dogs to large fluffy dog breeds. They are adorable and most people would love to have a fluffy companion. While the cuddling of these dogs should be acknowledged, it's also important to note that all that fur serves a purpose beyond the cute factor. So which of these fluffy dogs is your favourite? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to like, subscribe and share with all your friends. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one.